Welcome, and we are playing Tales of Symphonia. We are on episode 70. Holy crap, you guys. And we only have a few more pieces of the game to do. Ooh, good doctor. Doctor, doctor! Thank you! Thank you, Regal. Aeonis? Is it? Come on I in. don't want you. Girls go cookies. Lloyd, did I wake you? It's snowing outside. I was wondering why it was so cold. Yeah, Vicky. it's really cold. You sure sound happy. Yeah, I mean, I can actually tell it's cold. I'm so happy. Oh yeah, I forgot. She couldn't feel for That's a long right. time. You couldn't feel things like that just a little while ago, huh? Say, Lloyd, if you don't mind the cold, do you want to go for a little walk? Yeah! Sure. Lloyd's gonna get some. Lloyd's gonna get some! <laughs> look, look! You can see out over the city! It's so beautiful! Yeah. Lloyd, do you remember what Krato said? What was it? He said we can throw the x spheres away at any time. But right now, we need to carry the burden of the hopes and dreams of the victims and fight on their behalf. Oh, that. That was when we saw x spheres being made at the human ranch in Silverant. He was talking about your mother, wasn't he? But he works willingly for the boss of the guy responsible for turning my mom into a monster. I don't think that's true. Krato saved us over and over again. And he protected you too, Lloyd. Yeah, but... And so, I'm sure he cares about both you and your mother. He's a wonderful father, don't you think? Is that why you brought me out here? To tell me that? Um... Hmm... Yeah, I guess that was part of it. Thanks, but it's okay. I'm not really shocked about the fact that he's my father anymore. But... Origin Seal? I'm sorry for bringing it up, but if he unleashes all the mana from his body, then not even he could... I know. No one knows if he'll survive or not. And that's why we need to find a way to release Origin without Kratos losing his life. Just like the way you saved me. That's true. Orig they people always thought that you can, you know, save the chosen. Colette, I'm sure everyone will understand. Okay, please. Thanks, Colette. But I look at it this way: Kratos has his reasons for siding with Mythos. 
and I want to hear what those are. Anything else I do is going to wait until after that. That's... I think that's reasonable. Because we don't want to make any rash decisions. Going, aren't you? To Darius Carlon. Yeah. yeah. I plan to go after we check on Altessa's condition tomorrow. I don't agree with Mythos's vision. I have to prevent it from happening. Mythos has a good intention. He's just doing it wrong. Like, a world without discrimination. I mean, that's the dream world. But he's going about it in the wrong way. He wants to make everybody the same. That's not going to help. It's going to show that... It's gonna enforce the idea that no, that we nobody can get along. We need to learn to. People need to just learn to coexist with one another. I mean, I think the whole world has the same problem, and that's that's why I'm. I think I'm loving this game even more than when I first started playing, and I, I I've just loved this game I'm so much. I'm going to fight him. Is it okay if I come a little closer? Girl, you can get yourself some. Um, sure. I don't want to see this beautiful scenery ruined the way Silverant was. That's just, well. You guys remember? Uh, Mythos mentioned, you no, know, the prospering. You know, uh, Tethyala. Maybe it's been prospering I too won't long. Let that happen. This time, we're going to protect it, right? Yeah. Do you know the seventh dwarven vow? <laughs> the one you hate the most, right? Goodness and love will always win. I really hope that's true. Are it will ready? be. Then, take this. What's this? It's a charm. A Flanor snow bunny. They say it brings good luck. I had them take one to Altessa earlier. And this one's for you. Thanks. Lloyd, we're all with you. Now that you have a charm, too, everything will work out okay. Yeah, you're right. I wonder if I can equip that. Maybe it raises my luck. <laughs> that seems too believable. <laughs> Shut up, bird. Guys, how's Altessa? It seems he is out of danger. Right now, some people from Mizuho and the doctor are watching over him. Good. I need to speak with everyone. The world is never going to change if we just wait for Crucius to make the next move, right? So this time, we're going to strike them first. Well, so you're finally ready to do it. We're going to raid Crucius. Yeah, I have two objectives. Prevent the establishment of Mythos's new age and release Origin. But if you release Origin, what about Kratos? I don't really know yet. We don't know for certain that he'll actually die. We also don't know if he'll side with us or not. We don't have the time to worry about things we're not sure of. What do you intend to do about the Eternal Sword? Even if you break Origin's seal, you can't wield it, remember? And I doubt either Genus or I would be able to handle a sword. Don't worry about that. I've got it covered. What are you talking about? Why do you think I can use magic swords? I received magic injections with the latest in Tetheala technology. In other words, I'm a human with elven blood in me. That should work, shouldn't it? Then I guess this will be the final battle. Understood. A whole bunch Let of parts. This. For the sake of uniting the worlds. Yeah. I'll do my best, too. Colette. I need you to stay behind. Why? They want you as Martel's vessel. We'll have either Mizuho or the Renegades hide you. If that's what you want. Well, I keep you safe, girl. No, I'm going to. But <laughs> I get it. You don't think you can protect her. That is so sad. What did you say? Don't worry, Colette. I, the great Zelos, swear to protect you. Zelos! Take her along, Lloyd. They're gonna be after her no matter where she is. 
You ought to know that by now. Be a man. Show her what you're made of. Wow. We actually have the same opinion for once. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, People Lloyd, agree with themselves. I'm jealous this time. All right. Colette will come with us, okay? Thank you, Lloyd. And everyone else, too. Does Ted the Hella really have a technology like that? It sure does, for some weird reason. All right, let's go kick some Crucius butt, Lloyd. Zelos, I trust you. What? What are you talking about? Well, of course I can understand that you're counting on me. Just place your faith in me. Faith, huh? I hope so. Yeah, yeah, come on, let's go! Zelos has been kind of off lately. I think I'm gonna go back to Okay, let's see. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just found out there's a determining point where it'll determine if Zelos or Kratos is in your party. I want to see this. I'm sorry, you guys. I got I got to find out. Okay, so we're just going to kind of speed through this. We're gonna, I got I got to find that. La la la. la yeah, I don't care. Okay, we already saw this scene. Blah 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 yeah I'm going to try and see if this is right because the guy on and the guy says I don't know if it's for sure. Okay. So Mm-hmm yeah yeah people me who's oh yeah 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 I know it'll cost you Yes you're a dick I know I understand completely yes okay goodbye Okay, so supposedly we have, I have to decline everybody's offer, and eventually I'll just go outside. Supposedly. Who is Lloyd? How's one? That's Do you want We're just going oh. to see. I'm getting all happy and excited at a time like this, when I'll- Aww. I kind of want to see all the scenes. Have you looked and outside? What we uh, who is it? Are we going down the line hey, of everybody? I, uh, I see. Wow, that's some snow. Lloyd. Did someone just call my name? Supposedly huh. this will exchange things. Supposedly this will exchange Zelos for Kratos. Did you know I was your son the whole time? I realized it when I found Anna's grave at your house. How did Mom die? You know, don't you? Like Prisea, Anna was a research subject of the Angelus Project. They were trying to create a Crucius crystal inside her body. When I learned of Mythos' plan to create an age of lifeless beings, I turned against him and descended upon this land, where I met Anna. So Mom was an experimental subject, just like Prisea. After meeting Anna, I realized my mistake in believing that accepting Mythos' vision would be the fastest route to reunite the worlds. I began to search for a way for a human to wield the Eternal Sword. So you can unite the worlds? Yes. 
However, Anna and I were pursued by Crucius. We traveled from place to place, and when you were born, with you as well. But we were finally caught by Kavar. And then Mom was turned into a monster. Her exphere was removed. Lacking a key crest, the mana in her body went out of control, and she turned into a monster. When it tried to devour you, Noish protected you, and Anna regained control of herself momentarily. Noish saved me? That's probably when Noish became sensitive to monsters. Noish and Anna were both wounded. Your mother begged me to kill her. I've heard enough. Anna went out of control again and turned on you. Then I... That's enough! I... killed her. I said that's enough! After that, Kavar attacked. Then you and Noish fell down the cliff along with the X-Sphere. I fought off Kavar and his men and descended the cliff. But all that was left were the design corpses, half eaten by monsters. But I thought there was no way you could still be alive. Is that when you returned to Crucius? I am the origin seal itself. Since killing me would break the seal, Yggdrasil couldn't just leave me alone. And you were okay with that? Even though you opposed what he was doing? Everything felt meaningless. Mythos said he would reunite the worlds as soon as Martell was revived. I came to think that as long as the land would return to normal, that would be enough. Until I met you. Me? You remind me of Mythos. Just like you, Mythos was desperately trying to save the world. He didn't give up. No matter how much he was oppressed, he was hopeful. Until the day Martell was killed. A hero. That's what people call him. Yes. But there is a clear difference between you and Mythos. Our race? No, not that. You realize that you are capable of making mistakes. Or <laughs> if you make a mistake, you are capable of acknowledging it. That takes courage. Mythos, as well as I, were unable to do that. The courage to acknowledge one's mistakes? We were incapable of correcting our flawed path. We gave up on correcting our mistakes. You didn't give up. If you feel that way, then you must have realized it by now. Mistakes can be corrected. It's not too late. Let's look for a way to release Origin without sacrificing your life. Together. I still have something I must do. Until I am able to entrust it to you, I cannot fight alongside you. Something you have to do? The Eternal Sword. Until I am able to entrust it to you, do not die, Lloyd. Kratos, where are you going? Do not allow Yggdrasil to continue as he pleases. He is capable of sacrificing any number of lives. Stop Yggdrasil, stop Mythos, before Colette is taken from you again. I'll stop him. I'll head to Darius Carlon and put an end to this. Oh, Noish! What's that in your mouth? Ah. A pendant? What is... It's Kratos and... Mom? Then... This baby must be... me. <laughs> Kratos gave this to you, didn't he? Uh? Okay. I'll hang on to it. <laughs> Guys, how's Altessa? It's... Right now, the what? I don't. We, we, what? What do you? Why do you think I can use? Uh, another. That's under. Yeah. Uh, collect. They will. If. No. But. 
take her along, Lloyd. Wow. So... Does Ted Thayala really... It sure... All right. Zella, can I... What are you saying? Of course you can trust me. I'm the type that responds to people's trust. Really? Really, 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 come on, let's go!
leave this to me. Leave it to you? What are you gonna do? I figured something like this might happen, so I prepared a little something the last time we were here. Colette, come here for a second. Huh? Oh, okay. Good work, Chosen. Now, bring her to me. Sure thing. Zelos! What the hell are you doing? Oh, shut up. I'm just putting myself on the winning side. What you're trying to do is hopeless and meaningless. What's the big deal? Colette wanted to be a sacrifice, remember? Zelos, you traitor! It's so funny that you would say that. It, it's not like you trusted me in the first place. Betray you? How amusing. Zelos was our spy from the very beginning. Isn't that right, Zelos? Is that true? It's not true, is it? Please say that she's lying. I side with the strongest. It was a simple matter of weighing the renegades, Crucius, and all of you. You were leaking information to the renegades too? I can't believe you! You were always a pervert, but I never doubted that you were a good person when it came down to it. Why, thank you, my sweet voluptuous honey. But in the end, I choose this side. Because Mythos promised to release me from my fate as a chosen of mana. You hate being the Chosen so much that you would betray your friends? Oh yeah, I do. It's because of that title that my life has been a total joke. I can't stand it. I can't wait for Celeste to become the Chosen instead. You're lying. I still trust you, you hear me? You're the one that told me I could trust you! What are you, stupid? Lady Pranima, hurry and take Colette. I leave the rest to you. So, this is how it ends. Why, Zelos? You were our friend. Friend, huh? I never did get you to trust me, though. That was... Don't feel bad about it. I mean, I did deceive you, after all. Well, there's gotta be some sort of explanation for all this. This is just another joke, right? <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I'm just a weak, lazy bum. All I want is a fun, easy life. That's it. Nothing more, nothing less. Well, go all out, right? You bastard! You can call me whatever you like, but it's not gonna change it. You ready? Double demon bang! We have to stop this! Eruption! Light spear landing! Oh, 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 demon bang! Rising Thunder Blade! 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 Rising Thunder Blade!
Thunder Blade! Rising Falcon! Fierce Demon Fang! Rising Falcon! Like Nurse! Thanks. Lightning Blade! Super Lightning Blade! Rising Falcon! Lightning Blade! Trusted you. That, that was pretty good. Zelos. It's okay. To tell you the truth, I was getting pretty tired of living anyway. Don't talk like that. Oh yeah. About Colette. She's below, in the Hall of the Great Seed. Make sure you save her. Why did you fight us? Because my life was a mistake. But once I'm gone, Celeste might be happier and they'll finally let her out of that abbey. Don't tell me that's why you... <laughs> nah, that's just a bonus. Make sure you destroy my Crucius Crystal. Damned idiot. Is it still active? Looks like it. Let's go.
This is still gonna happen. I just wanna see if Zealous is really gonna be a dick. Cause this seems like a really big, you know, portion. This is gonna make me insane. Leave this to me. Leave it to you? What are you gonna do? I figured something like this might happen, so I prepared a little something the last time. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Colette. Co huh? Mm hmm. Good work, Chosen. Now. Oh, it's sure gonna thing. happen either way. Zelos! What the hell are you doing? Oh, shut up. I'm just putting myself on the winning side. Okay, so... For... I think it is a relationship score. Um... I know I read a little bit into the thing about that. Either way. Well, here's the thing. If you really, really tried hard to be friends with Zelos, supposedly you will fight off the angels instead. So. So, yeah, this sucks, sadly. Uh, well, it's a good thing and a bad thing. Well, it kind of sucks that we lost a party member. I know. Shut up. I'm just doing stuff. All right, you guys. Um, so in the end, uh, we find out that uh, unless we're like pa super palsy wowsy of those, we are gonna end up killing him. So don't don't, don't bother. <laughs> I never bother other than me. Alright, you guys. Um, like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe. It helps me out. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.